Hollywood mourned Oscar-winning actor William Hurt Sunday, after his death at 71. His son, Will, attributed the death to natural causes, but Hurt diagnosed with terminal prostate cancer in 2018. Hurt was one of the most acclaimed stars and bankable leading men of the 1980s, starring as Vietnam veteran Nick Carlton in the all-star ensemble playing College Friends reuniting in 1983's The Big Chill. He was also well known for Kiss of the Spider Woman, for which he won his leading actor OSC. He said Hurt died peacefully, among family. Will Hurt told The Hollywood Reporter his father died at his home in Portland, Oregon. Albert Brooks, Hurt's co-star in James L. Brooks' 1987 film Broadcast News, wrote about Hurt's passing. So sad to hear this news, Brooks tweeted. Working with him on Broadcast News was amazing. He will be greatly missed. Hulk and Marvel star Mark Ruffalo wrote on Twitter, Wow, another major loss to the acting community. Great actor. Great mind. R.I.P. Saddened to hear of the passing of actor William Hurt. He broke the mold in his Oscar-winning role in Kiss of the Spider-Woman, broke smiles in broadcast news, and broke our hearts in The Accidental Tourist. A great loss to the world. Rest among the stars now, good sir, George Takei tweeted. Author Stephen King also shared a few words on Twitter, writing, Very sorry to hear about the passing of William Hurt. He was a fine actor, an Academy Award winner. He also did a classic reading of my story Low Men in Yellow Coats, from Hearts in Atlantis. I loved hitchhiking on his immense talent. So truthful, real and always compelling. Too young to be saying goodbye. This one hurts Rip William Hurt, Crampton tweeted. Director M. Night Shyamalan, who worked with Hurt on 2004's The Village, tweeted, I'm so sad to hear of the passing of William Hurd. I had the privilege of directing him in the village. He was a master of his acting craft. Every take was new and revealing. Antonio Banderas shared a photo of Hurd on Twitter and wrote, A great actor has left us. R.I.P. William Hurd, 